Hey, hi. Uh, so this is a little awkward. We're, um, we're making the plaster masks. This is great. Um, we ran kind of, we don't have any more plaster left. Sorry. Whoops. We have, I mean, we have some left, but really not enough. Um, so guess what? No problem. We're going to make this work still. We have something that is similar to plaster. It's called paper. Mache. So, same deal. It's really very similar. It's just not plaster. Let's say you're doing the project where you have two faces. You've made your two masks. Everyone has made two masks, so that's fine. You are going to attach them back to back. The way you keep them together is to start by putting some tape on them. You don't need a crazy amount. It's two or three pieces. Cool, cool. Is it lined up the right way? Yeah. You might want to trim the edges so they're not so crusty. This is just a demonstration, so whatever. All right, piece of tape here. Another piece of tape here. All right, for now they're staying together. Then, I have a million and a half pieces of scrap paper in the front of the room. It's right up there behind the aprons. It's always been there. You're gonna take some paper and you will rip them into strips. Cutting them makes sense, doesn't it? But weirdly, it just does not work as well. There's like a sharp edge and it shows up. When you rip it, it gets kind of thin at the sides and it blends in nicely. It's just a, a better thing to use. Rip them. You have a pile of strips. And at your table, you're going to have a tray that has a mixture of glue and water. You have your face in front of you. You're going to take a piece of the paper strip, kind of dip it in the gross mixture. Try to get as much off as you can. You don't want it dripping and oozing with glue. So it's like a little bit, but do you see it dripping too much? No. But it is nice and wet and coated with glue. You're going to place it on and smooth it out along your face. Like I said, you should take off the bumpy parts because it won't make it look as nice. You want to make about three layers of this at least so it's nice and firm. It's not as strong as plaster, but it's still going to work just fine. If you need to add other things, you can get more paper. And, and tape. Same deal. Let's make a unicorn. Horn. Tape. Wrap it up real nice with tape. You can tape it to the head. And then cover it with paper mache. All the way. A couple layers. It will still totally work. Sorry, ran out. <laughs>